Happy almost Halloween friends. It is that time of year. I am so excited to put my children's boo baskets together. If you guys are new here, welcome, welcome, welcome. It's awesome to have you. I have two kids. I have a daughter named Penelope who is two and a half. I have a son named Maximilian who is five and I love to do boo baskets for them every single year. Before moving forward, I do have quite a bit of new subscribers, which I'm so grateful that you guys are here, that you have found the channel, that you continue to click on the videos. And I'm just so thrilled to have you. It really is an honor. If you are new and you haven't subscribed yet and you're enjoying the content or you love to do the shop with me's and hauls, hit that red subscribe button, like this video. You can also find me on Instagram at the name is Jeanette. All right, so I have a combination of all sorts of stuff from different stores. I love to shop at Home Goods, so I have a good amount of stuff from Home Goods, TJ Maxx, Spirit Halloween, Target, and surprisingly this year I did not shop the Walmart Halloween, but that's okay because I have enough stuff here and I think we're done. All right guys, so let's get into what's in these boo baskets. At the end of the video, I will kind of put the uh, baskets together um, on time lapse or maybe with some music over it. So if you wanna see me putting them together, stick until the end uh, so you can check that out. But for now, I'm going to show you what's actually inside of the baskets. I did a shop through at Spirit Halloween. I am obsessed with that store. I bought so much stuff for myself, so much stuff for my kids. Kids. It's amazing. I got some home decor stuff. I'm not sure if I'm going to do any more Halloween videos. This might be it. Actually, I did start to see Christmas stuff. So I might start transitioning in October to holiday. Um, I know, right? Halloween was fun while it lasted, but we got to end it somewhere. I might do maybe like a decor, like a decorate with me video, maybe uh, making Halloween treats, which I actually did last year and it was a lot of fun. But for the most part, this is probably it for Halloween hauls. I found this amazing cloud pillow. It is literally called Travel Cloud Pillow. That is the brand here. Penelope already has plushies, so I think I'm gonna give this to Mr. Max and it'll fit nicely in at the bottom of his boo basket. One more item from Spirit Halloween. And if you've seen my Spirit Halloween, again, you've probably seen this. I love the movie Beetlejuice. My kids don't know what it is. I think they're still too young to watch it, but they will eventually. Uh, Lydia from Beetlejuice, they had all four characters, but I love how gothic she looks in her little black clothes and her little mesh there. And she has her little camera. She has her little camera, so I thought this was super great. All right, let's get into some clothing items because I always add a little bit of clothing in there. Um, since I just showed you Lydia from Beetlejuice, I did get Mr. Max a t-shirt from the movie Beetlejuice. It is a little creepy, I'm not gonna lie, but again, I love this movie. I think it's so cool. Max is not spooked out by anything like like this so he'll wear this just fine um, and it says it's showtime so I found this on target.com great addition to a boo basket hocus pocus all the rage right the movie is coming out hocus pocus 2 September 30th on Disney plus super excited for that I found a little hocus pocus dress for Miss Penelope isn't this amazing I actually saw this in store on the rack at Target I had to grab it you can see it right there on the label it even says hocus pocus and one more clothing item for Miss Penelope because you know she's a girly girl she likes the dresses this here is a Jack Skellington on this cute little black dress. I love the tool on there. Look at that. It's like shiny and metallic and glittery. It's silver. And then it has that pretty white tool there in the middle. Um, so this is going to be great for Halloween. A couple more items from Spirit Halloween. These are little blind bags, which I think are great for boo baskets uh, because they're just fun. They're entertaining. You open them. You don't know what you're going to get. And then you get a little keepsake. So this is the Haunted Mansion. Here, let me show you there. All right, crafting stuff. I got a ton of stuff from Target. The dollar spot had really great clings. Um, this is actually from the dollar spot and it costs a dollar. I love doing these with my kids. We have tons of windows in this house. So these are always fun. These are also from the dollar spot. It says happy Halloween, same price, a dollar. And then this set of window clings, this is actually from Spirit Halloween. I picked it up at the Nightmare Before Christmas section. Um, I think it retailed, yeah, these retailed for $6.99, so a little bit pricier than a dollar spot, but these are better quality. They're thicker and the colors are more vibrant and they're characters, right? They're actually Nightmare Before Christmas. I found this amazing Halloween countdown calendar. I actually found this in the um, stationery, no, the greeting card section at Target. And it's a little countdown with Mickey and Minnie. They're dressed up for Halloween, they're trick-or-treating. I just picked up an assortment of stickers. These are all by the American Greeting. Again, I found these in the little greeting card section at Target. Well, it's not little, it's actually a large section. They have every greeting card you can imagine. You got sparkly, shiny ones. You got 
ghosts and skeletons and pumpkins on this one and then these cute little ghosts here a lot of these are like um puffy stickers which penny likes uh, they're great for crafting these spinners are so cool i actually found these at cracker barrel we were just driving by and i was like you know what let's go in that store we didn't even eat there and i was like i want to see if they have halloween stuff they had tons of halloween stuff and they retailed for 8.99 this flashlight i actually saw it at lowe's i bought this in my local supermarket believe it or not they actually have like a massive halloween section but um i saw these at lowe's as well they have a ghost one they have a witch one which is this one and then they have a pumpkin one this one is really cool because it projects the witch but you can also switch it to another setting um if your kid just wants to do um a regular light here and do like spooky time or like spooky story time under the covers how cool are these little squishy pens i found these at home goods there are two in the pack because my kids need more more things that light up i found this at my local supermarket believe it or not it was very inexpensive again max loves lights and flashlights he can just spend hours playing with flashlights the price that i got this for i thought it was a steal it was about four bucks and it projects really really nicely and i love the colors on it i did find some books for the kiddos boo baskets haunted mansion one of our favorite disney attractions this one will go in mr max's boo basket nightmare before christmas one of our favorite halloween movies this one is going in miss penelope's basket and again these two are golden books little golden books you can find them on amazon although i did buy them at target.com this book here i found at the target dollar spot it says beautiful halloween halloween party pippa how cute is she this i actually found at once upon a child that's right the secondhand vintage store they have a ton of books practically untouched and uh, i can't believe how inexpensive i got this book it's a dollar fifty i don't even think this book was ever opened it's like practically brand new this one here i also found at the thrift store once upon a child it is called 10 little pumpkins i did also see this one at target though if you are interested in picking it up the last book that i picked up at once upon a child they had a whole section of Halloween books. I was so surprised. This one retailed for $1.50. It's huge. It's super cute. It's practically brand new and the illustrations are amazing. Again, I will show you the price there. You can't go wrong with the prices of the books at Once Upon a Child or the clothing. It's such a steal when you go there. These I showed in my last Target haul, so you've probably recently seen it. Uh, these are by the Hide and Eat Boutique brand at Target. These retail for $3 a piece. I love getting my kids the seasonal plates. I bought them both the same um, Happy Halloween one with the pumpkin and then I decided to get each one something different. So I got the little witchy cat for Miss Penelope and the plate that has the skeleton and says, hey boo for Mr. Max. Cups, cups, and more cups. We have so many cups here, but we use them. I did pick up Oogie Boogie for Miss Penelope because currently I think that's her favorite character. And then this one here was a Target dollar spot find. This retailed for $3 and it is a trick or treat cup. It says trick or treat there, has the pumpkin, comes with a little straw. Another hide and eat find for crafting and playing around and trick or treating and Halloween parties. These are little glow sticks, but they're shaped uh, like different things, swords, wands. You can make bracelets. You can make all sorts of cool stuff. This one here has like a skeleton hanging. You get two bags of these for a Halloween party or trick-or-treaters. You're all set. Oh, I love these. I actually want to keep these for myself. They actually match my shirt. These are from Disney World, and they are from the Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween. They are slap bracelets, uh, and they have all the little characters there that are featured in the 2022 Mickey's Not So Scary lineup. And then on the back here, it says Happy Halloween, which I thought was super cool and that's how they work dollar spot got me again little light up things again for the pumpkin blaze and nighttime stories and all that all these little things kids love them these only retail for a dollar so how could i not for a dollar candy 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 because that's really what halloween is about right like let's get the sweets in um so i did find a good amount of treats i found this amazing unicorn marshmallows oh my god enchanted vanilla how cute is this i found this at home goods four dollars and 99 cents this is a massive bag for five bucks and i'm probably gonna help her with this because these look so tasty i love marshmallows personally gummy fingers these are by the hide and eat brands these are fruity flavored they're icky and gross and penny's going to love it oh i love these so much i actually also bought these at disney world see i was already planning guys in august i was like all right i gotta start my boo baskets i start christmas shopping in september i already started christmas shopping it's kind of crazy but while i was at disney world i was like these would be a fantastic addition to Penelope's boo basket these are gummy butterflies and they have daisy on there and then these are like the sour worms and then they have uh, angel from Lilo and Stitch last two I swear I swear these are the last two these were just so cute and again they're kind of like souvenir slash boo basket candy 
I got them at Disney World. It is a huge, massive Mickey swirly lollipop. And then you have the little Mickey Pops, which are the smaller version. These are great because you can actually divide these up and give one to each child. Oh my gosh, last items. I am super excited about these. I haven't had Silly Streamers. Is that what they're called? Silly Streamers in years. I found these at Target and I was like, what a great idea for the Boo Basket. So much fun. They are a little bit messy if you're doing it inside, but if you take it outside or if you're willing to clean it up, I'm willing to clean it up for a little bit of fun. I don't think Max will notice. He's not going to know that I opened it, but let's give it a shot. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> so much fun. That is my boo basket haul. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. I hope I was able to give you some ideas for some boo baskets and Halloween treats. If you're enjoying the content, don't forget to hit that red subscribe button and like this video and Christmas is coming, lots of fun videos coming. So do subscribe and say hi, say something in the comments. I'd love to hear from you guys. All right, I'll catch you guys on the next one. Happy Halloween.